All right, if you've watched this channel before, you know that One Inch is an altcoin project that I talk about a lot. And it's not just that I talk about them just for the sake of talking about it. This is a project that I actually use. This is the DEX that I like to go to. They are the leader as far as DEX aggregation. So I wanna talk about what that is, but I realize I've never actually showed like what it is about One Inch or how to actually use it. And I know DEXs are, are pretty simple to use, but there's a lot of specific features here in this One Inch platform that are exclusive to One Inch, hence why I like it. You can do more here than some other places. Plus, they have the whole DEX aggregation. And if you don't know what that means, the easiest way for me to explain it to you is like when you go, if you're looking for, you're traveling somewhere and you need a hotel to stay at, you could go and you could go to any various of these websites and look for a hotel. But some are like Hotwire or Orbitz and they're pulling information from a bunch of different sites. They're aggregating these best prices for you. And that's what One Inch is doing when it comes to gas fees. So that's just one feature of it. If you look over here, very simple to use. And if you come direct to the platform right here, app.oneinch.io, right now you'll see along the top, they have all of the categories, the headings up here. I'm gonna get into break down some of these things and how they actually work. But if we start right here at the trade, first one here, you're populated straight into the simple mode. But if that's not something you like personally, I like the simple mode because it's very clean and simple to look at. They also though have the classic mode. And I think some people are more familiar with this. You have the graph, you have this over here, but then additionally, you can select it here or here up on top. You can also create limit orders. So unlike some centralized exchanges like crypto.com or Coinbase, some of these others, you can't create these limit orders, but here you can, you can cre quickly create a limit price for the exact selling price when you wanna go buy and trade the cryptocurrencies. The other cool thing that they have here is this P2P deal. So this is P2P swaps. This is the ability to swap cryptocurrency in a decentralized, secure way with somebody else. So you don't have to use one inch at all. You don't have to use the liquidity pools in one inch. You could find a friend and you can come in here and say, I wanna uh, swap one WETH or any currency that you want, select anything that you want for DAI or for anything else. And then what you do is they're gonna tell you how much the price is and you put this token address, the zero X address of the person that you're gonna swap with. And when, once it does that, it's gonna generate a URL you can send them and the swap happens instantaneous and autonomously just between the two parties. So one inch is out of the equation in this case, just generating this link for the P2P swap. But in any event, First thing you wanna do when you come over here is you're gonna to have to connect your wallet. So just like any decentralized exchange, any decentralized application you're gonna to, to use, come over here and connect your wallet. And when you come to One Inch, there's a lot of options and that's good sometimes, and that's why we're doing this video, maybe you think it's a little overwhelming, but it's it's really not, right? Obviously, you're gonna to have to accept the terms and conditions, read them at your own time. The next step here is you're gonna choose the network. And this means what blockchain do you wanna be interacting on? So for me right now, in the purpose of this demo, we're gonna choose Ethereum, but again, BNB chains available, Polygon's available, all of these other chains, roll up chains to Ethereum available as well. And then the third step and final step here is you choose the wallet you're gonna be using. So you do need a decentralized wallet, whether it's the one inch wallet connect, I use MetaMask, but Coinbase wallet, all these wallets here are good. And if you have them installed into your browser, they will work. So for the purpose of this, we'll just go and we'll accept the terms. We'll select Ethereum and we'll go MetaMask and boom, now we're connected. Our wallet address is appearing here and we're connected and we can transact however we want. So like I showed you right here, all these deals are up here, but then we also have some other cool features like some other swaps as well. So they have the whole DAO. So if you wanna come here and participate in staking and with one inch staking, it's a little bit different than some other staking. Obviously by staking, you're gonna get instant governance. So you're gonna be able to vote on proposals. You're gonna be able to create proposals. They also have what they call DAO governance. And I think the easiest way to think about the separation between these two is instant governance. This is what's happening right now. So like the day-to-day -day operations of the blockchain. Whereas DAO governance is more of a long-term vision, like what products, how do we wanna get involved in Web3 in maybe a year or six months or two years? Whereas instant governance is more of that day-to-day. -day. But then on the top here, you see this gas refund. And this is something exclusive to One Inch, and they are actually reimbursing you up to 100% of your Ethereum trading gas fees for just trading on One Inch. And by staking this token, 
obviously you see the amounts right here 25 percent if you stake 100 tokens you get up to 100 percent in reimbursement for staking 100,000 one inch tokens which i know is a lot right but you have to calculate this does it make sense for you are you doing that much trading where the fees are such that that is going to make sense for you to commit that much in staking you kind of like just do the math for yourself based on the amount of trading you're doing and see how this staking could benefit you so that's really nice there that staking is all right there but then beyond that also you can go over here to they have this liquidity protocol so you can see all the stats about their swap fees all this stuff and that's important when you want to come here and participate in some of the pools so they have their pools here where you can participate in their liquidity pools. They have the farming as well. So it's all here for you to take advantage of. And then one other thing that's really cool, they have all these bridges already built in. And like we always talk about, you know, it's nice that we can go to all of these different blockchains and transact in the DeFi sense. You know, I want to go to Arbitum today. I want to use Phantom today. But then it comes a little bit difficult when you got to move to chain to chain. So it's nice when you can come to a DEX that has all these other things, but then has integrations for seven bridges already built in. So you don't have to go and use an any swap. You don't have to go and use Phantom's native. You, it's all right here for you. And that's the simplicity that I think drives mass adoption. We're all talking about how do we get people to mass adopt crypto? How do we get people to, to come here and, and know how to use this? I think the simplicity of just this screen right here, so if we simple mode, and the simplicity of one touch, one tap, getting bridges for seven different chains in an easy, simplistic way, very, very good for breaking down that barrier to entry, very little friction, and that's how you get mass adoption in my opinion. The other cool thing right here is you can come here and you can just buy ETH. So look, this will go through a MoonPay, which is a centralized platform, and you can come here and you can use your fiat, your US dollars, or any other currency that you have, euros or hey or whatever you have, wherever country you have, you can come here and use your debit card, your bank account, and you can buy Ethereum instantly and that will get transported directly into your wallet so that's cool as well if we look right now at the one inch token which again has a lot of features to it right you have the staking aspect of it for the discounted fees on staking or on trading on ethereum you also have the two types of governance that you can participate in and if you are staking for the gas refund i encourage you also participate in the governance because look how do you think this gas refund came into place this was voted on proposed by the community so these are the things that are coming out and i think as we move forward with DAOs, with community governance this is going to be a very this is a extremely value-added service to an already you know very robust platform right now token 91 cents the whole market is down but you know Look, if this is something that is going to benefit you and you know you're trading a lot this is your you're a day trader you're somebody that's trading over and over again definitely go check out one inch not just for the gas refund but for all these other cool features that i've showed you if we come back over here to the one inch homepage, you come over here to the more you can read all about their documentation go and check out their blog they're very active on twitter big twitter community a lot of followers good team as well look i've met a lot of people on this team heavily focused on development. They're doing big things that we don't even know about right now. So look, they've already come out with their one inch wallet, which is actually really cool. I'm probably gonna do a separate video on that. The other cool thing about one inch, the mobile app is awesome. A lot of cool, everything that's here, so all these features, obviously on the mobile app, but some cool security and privacy features as well. You can view multiple chains, segregated. It's very, very nice. So there's a lot of cool things that here with One Inch. I just wanted to show you why this is the platform, why this is the DEX that I use most out of all of them. You can see right now all the features so I can come here. I don't I know I don't have to use Pancake Swap. I can just come here to One Inch, recently integrated with Orion Protocol as well. You know we talk about both platforms and protocols all the time here. So let me know what you think in the comment section. Until the next time, be safe.